Hey y'all, how's it going? This is Lisa, y'all know me. Um, I got a little crab seafood thing going on with some potatoes, sausage, and some corn on the cob. This is actually my first time doing this, so this is a very small, uh, what do you guys call it, a muck bag or whatever that <laughs> is? Okay, so we're gonna just try to dig through some of these potatoes first because they look really good. I got some seasoned butter here. I got a, a crab leg going on over here. We got some sausages in here and, um, you know, and this corn on top. And some, of course, lemon juice. Do you so. need a fork, mama? Sure. My daughter's gonna bring me a fork, but even though I'm gonna probably eat some, most of this with my fingers. So and she let them know that's my favorite sauce right there. Yeah, she wants you guys to know Ching Machine wants y'all to know this is her favorite butter sauce. Well, her famous butter sauce. I know potatoes are very, very hot. It's the sauce. But they're pretty good. Do you have a knife, honey? <laughs> See, no, I don't really eat with my fingers. I like to eat with a knife. <laughs> this now I have her bring me some napkins too if she got something over there. This is the proper seat. I'm old school. I still eat with a fork and a knife and use napkins, you guys. Not saying you don't, but you know, I'm, I'm most comfortable with that. So we're gonna try this here. It's pretty good. Butter sauce good. Butter sauce is good. Not a lot of salt because you know I can't eat a lot of salt, so that works out perfectly. Thank you. I got some. At your service, Miss oh, Lisa. Look what kind of nice she ate. A little chopped nice. Right? <laughs> so I guess I have to chop my way through the food. But it's okay. So here goes, y'all. Last day for work. <laughs> and a chopping knife. This is what she gave me. You know, because we out here, we in the shop, so we don't really have a whole lot of utensils here anyway. So it's not like we at home. So, But I got to do this this way. That's the only way I'm going to but it's very good, I, I will agree. I'm about to dig into this crab leg though. I know. Um, she get back in. Bottom girl, bottom. Uh. <laughs> I'm gonna need some scissors or something to probably cut this thing open. I'm gonna have to look at some videos or something because I don't even know how to crack these things. I've been eating crab legs for a long time. I'm used to just popping them or cracking them with a fork or something like that. And I got old handy scissors here. So we're going to do them like this. Because that's the only way I can get in there. And I'm going to pull it apart. Wow. Pull that Look at all that meat. Pull that, that claw out. This one? No, the claw first so you can get that string down. Yeah, I'm trying. They kind of got some heck of a claws on them. They're they really sticky right here. They're sticking me in the finger, so we're going to use these scissors again because I'm not going to try to pull it. Get all stuck up. So, yeah, that's a nice piece of meat there. Look at that. Perfect. Beautiful. Mm. Let's see how it tastes. Delicious. Mmm. 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 good. Yes. So, I'm just going to enjoy myself here. And let's try the sausage because I haven't tried that. And I guess we had the company called the Potato Bar. 87. Created this meal for us. And they did an absolutely good job because it tastes great. Worked out good. No hardly no salt. So if any of y'all is suffering from high blood pressure like me, salt is one thing you don't need. So kudos to them on that one. But some people just sock their food down very badly. I'm going to try this corn. Let's 
See how we do with that, dip it in this famous butter sauce. Nice and sweet. <laughs> My daughter laughed at me, y'all. And I don't know why. What? Get your fingers dirty. Get I'm going to get my fingers dirty, but she know I don't eat like that. Oh, okay. I'm so used to sitting at a desk most of the time and, you know, if I don't really wash my hands properly before I eat, I always use a fork and a knife because I don't want to touch my food with my fingers. So I very rarely eat with my fingers. But sometimes you just can't help it. Like right now on this crab leg. So I'm going to try another piece here. And that's a big old piece right there. Look at that. That's gorgeous. I love seafood. Shrimp is my favorite. No shrimp today, ma'am. Lobster is awesome. And crabs are great. I just seen a lobster. The lobster was forty dollars. The for one. And that's he, a whole lobster. No, lobster just the tail. tail. But the tail was like this long. And look, this wide. What in the world? We should have got that. <laughs> we get that for the next one. Mm -hmm. Make so, sure y'all like this video if y'all want us to do a, a a boil together. Yeah, that'd be great. If you guys want us to do a boil together, like this video. I like that video. Kino Herka. So, guys, I'm just moseying on along with this. Mm -hmm. It tastes really good. I'll be doing more food videos too for you guys. Because I love to eat. That's one thing I like to do is eat. I love it. Especially if it's food that I like to eat now. But this is really awesome. Corn is great, got a nice texture to it. It's not too soft, it's not too hard. Yeah, break that joint. Yeah, push it. Yeah, push it. Push it, girl. Yes. Yes, girl. I got that part, but yes. the meat didn't come out. <laughs> I got to learn how to. It's easier to cut along the white part because that's the tender part. Just to... I know, but it's got a, it's got a curl in it. It's not. Oh yeah, look at that, y'all. It was very, very nice and neat. Plenty of meat. Nice, big old, pretty, and good. Mmm. <laughs> That's delicious. Yeah. Almost didn't get to say no. <laughs> Getting a little full here, but I'm definitely going to finish this crab leg off if I don't finish anything else. 
less potatoes. Oh, thank ya. You looking good in the neighborhood. <laughs> Next time we do one of these, my thing, I am not gonna use scissors. You try to do it the right way. Cause I see people, some people they break it, they pull all that meat out of That's there. That's for the snow crab though. Oh, snow crab, okay. You can't you can't just break a king crab to get the meat out. Oh, uh, I too. thought you could do it with all of them. Cause I did know this was But you got crab, it, ooh, ooh, that look good, girl. Let me get a piece. No, <laughs> look at that. She might let her get a piece. No. <laughs> she can have it. She tried her best. She got a crab leg uh, fuck bang also. That's going so, up today as well. She'll be putting it online for y'all today. Mm. That's good. That's really good. Every time I take a bite, I have to say that's really good because it's actually delicious. <clears throat> Got some purple potatoes here. Purple, purple potatoes. See purple on the inside, you guys, look at that. Let me see, let me show y'all. See, nice and purple on the inside. Actually, they got a good taste. Mm -hmm. It actually tastes better than a white potato. Okay, what's that? Better than a white potato, but just as good as a red potato. Still got some more crab left. Try to go ahead and finish it off. Nice big old piece of crab. Delicious. I put a little bit too much in there this time. I have a pretty big piece. Just a little bit more of this corn. Mm. Yeah, you guys, I'm gonna have some more videos for you guys. Look on um, Lisa's Life channel. There's a couple videos up there right now, but not a whole lot just yet, but I'm still working on some stuff. I know that much. That was quite a bit for me. Eat this last piece of crab because I don't want to leave that behind. That was awesome. So you guys, 
as you can see, had a great meal. It was cooked to perfection. I think I'm gonna go for another purple. <coughs> purple potato. Purple. Purple and pretty. Look at that. Those of you who have never tried purple potatoes, I suggest you to get some of these. They taste great. And it just gave me a thought. I might buy some purple potatoes and make some fried potatoes out of them because they, they taste good. And it seemed like they would be good with that. Some onions, garlic powder. Mm -hmm. I think they would be great fried. What? Purple potatoes. Oh, fried? Mm -hmm. We'll have one. They're good. You put them extra seasonings with it. I never ate a purple one today. And it's awesome. I didn't know it was purple all the way through. Yeah. That's beautiful. It tastes better than a white potato. It, it do? It's as good as a white potato. Let me taste that. I didn't even eat one, because I didn't even know the inside was purple. Well, you got some Sorry, y'all. I'm hopping in on this month, Mom. Yeah, like, she hopping in on this one, but she wouldn't let me hop in on hers. When she had everything going on. Ooh-wee. So anyway, you guys, that's good. Come here, baby, what's the matter? Why are you looking so sad? Come on. Come on, grand baby, you looking sad. You. Come on. <laughs> he had him some sausage off of here too. He liked it. But I'm just gonna eat a tiny piece of it just in case he wants another piece. And that's good. Once again, I'm going to say everything was totally delicious. Please like the video. And also check out some of my other videos on Lisa's Life. And hopefully you'll see me soon with some new videos. Bye.